So, uh, I am going to do a demonstration on how to properly iron your clothes. So, for this demonstration, I am going to iron this polo. Um, now, first, we need to make sure that um, your flat iron is plugged in. So, check for um, wiring damages first before you do it. So, it's already plugged in here. I'm going to use an extension, extension cord for it. And then we have here our ironing board and make sure that it's clean and free from any dirt. So to begin with, um, turn on your iron. And then we start at the back of the collar. So after the back of the collar, we move on to the front of the collar. And then next is the upper part of um, the side where there are no buttons. So we tuck it in the ironing board. Now if the sleeve won't fit in, um, totally, that's alright because we can do this at the uh, at the end of this process. So for now, we just um, tuck in whatever would fit, and then we start ironing from the from this side of the polo. until um, the part where the sleeve is actually tucked into this board to this ironing board. And then after that, we move on to the back side of, um, of this area. So we just have to adjust it this way without having to remove it from the ironing board. And then after this, we move on to the other side. So we are still at the um, back part of the polo. And then now we move on to the front side of it, where the buttons are. And then after that, we are now going to iron the lower part of the of, of this top so as you can see i am still here on the side where the buttons are because we are going to end up where we um begin with which is the side where there are no buttons and then we move on to the backs Back, back part of it. So for some cloth or fabric materials wherein it's difficult to iron, you can actually opt to use a sprayer. So spray some um, water on it just so it's going to be easier for you to iron. And then this side. And also another thing to remember is when once when you're ironing, um, if you have like small items, handkerchief, and like small items like that, 
you can actually do it at the end of your uh, at the end of your um of the other clothes that are quite difficult to iron because once you unplug your iron you can still use it you, there there would there would still be a heat on the iron for you to do the small items such as the handkerchief okay so now um we're back on this part of the claw of the of this um top where we actually um began earlier so the part wherein there is no buttons so that is the proper sequel on how to iron um a top or this polo and then since we were not able to fit in the sleeves earlier completely what we're gonna do is to iron it now starting from the back so we start from the back part again just like this and then the front side and then we move on to the other one Than the front side of it. Okay, now after ironing, if we are not going to hang it using a hanger, we would need to fold it. Okay, so we need to fold it properly. So by doing so, um, we have to button the shirt first. So button it up until the top. So now that we have already buttoned it, I button this uh, top up until this. Uh... Okay, so now that we have already buttoned this um, top, we are now going to fold it properly. So to fold it properly, face it down. Okay, and then from one side. Okay, so fold it like this, like lengthwise. And then for the sleeve, um, to properly fold the sleeve, it needs to be like in a triangular shape. So get this, um, get this tip and then move it across. And then you fo form like this uh, tri triangle shape here. And then we do it onto the other side of this um, top. So you fold it like that, like this, okay. And then do the other do the same thing get the tip and then fold it and then you should be able to create like this um, triangle shape here and then from the bottom we're gonna fold it into three parts so first this and then second up to here okay so the polo or this shirt should look like this so now this is the proper way on how to fold the top. After showing you the proper um, way or process on how to iron a top or this kind of polo. So after this, we just need to turn off the iron. Okay, turn off our flat iron. Unplug it. And then store it properly. Same with our ironing board. So we need to store um, our tools that we use for ironing the clothes properly. So that's about it. That is my demonstration on how to iron clothes. Thank you.